I'm just gonna get on with the video people so basically i was attacked earlier on guys unfortunately so guys where can i start i'm not gonna make no intro to this video because um you know it's not really a happy 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 yay video but yeah guys let me just tell you what happened you know everyone's been asking i went on live earlier on and loads of people were asking i thought you know what i will just make a youtube video about it and just let you guys know what actually happened so basically uh aisha so basically guys every morning i'll make my way to the shop and get a few groceries like bread milk or if i need some yogurt you know bits and bats so i've done, my, done, the, the, I've done the normal thing i've woken up i've got ready and i've just made my way to the shop it was about i'd say like 11 12 i made my way and basically there's a uh, i've took a different route so there's two routes to the shop there's one which goes straight on, on the main roads. And there's one that goes through a ginnel, which is an alleyway on the side of my house. And I've chosen to take this route, which is at the side of my house. So I proceed to walk. I'm walking, you know, chilling. And um, as I'm walking, guys, I've spotted two individuals on the other side of the road. And they seemed a bit, you know, weird. And they were acting a bit suspicious. But I didn't really pay much attention to it. Because, guys, I've lived in this area for, like, nearly three years when i when i looked at them they didn't they didn't look familiar to me because like you know when you see a new face and you're like yo like i've never seen these guys hang around here and like chill around here so like, what are these are doing here but anyways i didn't really pay much, much attention to it i just carried on walking got to the shop um i did my shopping you know as usual i've come out of the shop and i've carried on walking and guys i'm not gonna lie on the way back i was thinking shall i take like, I was thinking, should I take the main road back or should I take the ginnel back? And I just, I just went, I just came, I just basically went back home the same way I came. So I proceeded to walk, walk, walk. And I've seen them two guys again. And guys, they started shouting slurs, saying P-A-K-I, yeah, to me. Saying loads of racist, racist slurs and, you know, swearing at me. And guys, I just totally ignored it because obviously I don't want no problems. You know, I just want to do my own thing. And, you know, carry on with my day, get on with my day. Guys, I was fasting as well, so obviously I couldn't be bothered, guys. I had no energy, you know. I just wanted to get on with my day and, you know, do my thing. But these guys, they didn't want to leave me alone, so they started to... Well, I don't know what they threw. They threw, like, a bottle of water, but it went past my head. And I kind of looked at it and I thought, yo, what, what's wrong with these? Or why why these are like, like, you know, I was like getting these thoughts in my head. But like, I didn't ever think that these that these guys might attack me. I thought it'd be one of them things that, you know, when you walk past someone and they try like, you know, bully you and throw yeah, things at you. You get me, try winding you up and stuff. I, I thought that's what it was, but I was wrong. So I carried on walking and next minute, you know, guys, I've hit a ride to the alleyway. And I have to, could just hear footsteps, you know coming faster and faster but like again guys i just ignored it i thought i'm being paranoid it's nothing it's probably just kids running up and down so um, i was wrong guys so as soon as i turned around guys bam straight in my eye yeah one shot some guys p managed to punch me right here yeah it's all dried up now guys but he's punched me in my eye i've moved back i'm, I've, I'm kind of like shook i'm like shocked like yo like what the flip has just happened and guys i've kind of grabbed him to the fence and i've just kept him there from the neck and i'm just trying to stop him from punching me but he's had he's got his he's got his mate with him his mate was literally like i'll say like two meters apart two meters from us and he was walking up to us yeah okay so guys he was like two meters away from us and as i'm trying to stop this guy from punching me he's come to attack me and he's punched me at the back of my head i've got like a massive lump that you guys won't be able to see i've got like a lump here Punch me at the back of my head. So, guys, I've been concussion now. And I'm still there. I'm still trying to, fly, you know, fight back. I didn't run. I thought, you know, I'm just going to stand my ground. I'm not going to run. And another thing, I didn't want to run because it literally happened at the side of my house. And if these guys found out where I live, I didn't, basically, I didn't want them to know where I live. I didn't want anything to come, you know, anything happen to my missus or my child. I didn't want anything to come near my house. You get what I'm trying to say? As we're having this commotion, guys, one of the guys, guys, I don't know what, what name he said. He just shouted, yeah. It's like... You know when someone has a war and they, they say one name and everyone comes running out? It was like that. He said that and everyone... Uh, my dirty come up, looked at that. I've run, I'm running, 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 running. I've hit a left, up the ginnel, hit a left and I've jumped in my house because my house is like literally the... I'm not going to bait it out. Yeah, kiss your chick. But yeah, 
I just jumped in my house, came back home and obviously Aish was proper, proper shocked and she was just worried and, and I was like looking at me like, yo, what's wrong with him? And guys, I was like... Guys, I'll be honest, when I stood my door first, he must have been joking. Um, but when he started panicking and getting inside, he was telling me like, what just happened and stuff. He just basically started like rushing, he was just, every, he just started like rushing his ways and I was like... I was so like shocked because it was like an emergency, something was happening. Well, nice. And we've never had a situation like that since we've been married. Never. So, so guys... At first, I was more shocked. Mm. And then, yeah. Yeah, and that's it, guys. So, um... Thankfully, guys, the cut wasn't that deep. It was just like a little... It's like a little cut in the corner. It was so close to my eye. It could have damaged my eye, guys, easily. So, um, the reason why it's all dried up is because, guys, the, the bleeding is not stopping... And I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, A&E, it &E is packed. Even at the entrance, guys, they've got a massive queue. I'm not going to wait all night just for something that, you know, probably just needs time to heal. Um, but yeah, guys, I just wanted to give a quick, like, lesson out of this. Guys, like, look, this has happened to me. I'm not going to be upset about guys, it. Honest, and, is, um... and you know what, guys, I'm not going to lie. We've had a really good past month in it, haven't we? We've had a good time. We've had a good year so far. And, like... It's always when something good happens and something bad has to happen, isn't it? It's just... You know, it's more sad that um, it happened in Ramadan as well. In, in Ramadan as well, guys. I don't know what else to say to you lot. But yeah, guys, I'm just going to probably try, try clean the wound up a bit more. It looks black, the blood. Guys, we could, the thing is we could have reported it to police, but I feel like no, 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 reporting no. something like this would just make everything more... It would have, like, escalated because had it did... I like kicking back, obviously. Yeah, so, so I could have turned it on. It just would have gone back. Yeah. And the only reason I'm saying that is because our house was robbed and the police didn't do anything. Yeah. So why are they gonna do anything when something like this happens? True. It's like the past one two weeks, we've had like a really good. I don't know. I've been really happy. You get me? Like everything's been going smoothly. You know, Alhamdulillah. And then all of a sudden, boom! Someone has to punch me in my eyeball. Why are you laughing, guys? It's the way you said it, and why are you saying it like yeah, that? Yeah, still, man. Guys, it's not nice, man. But I'm looking at our area is really, really nice. Um, but you mentioned before, and you're like, you she goes. I'm not gonna lie, our area is really, really nice, but your husband's got a, a half an eyeball left. No, but you say you didn't recognize that guy. He might have. Yeah, they're not from the area, man. But I don't know what they were doing here. It's just baffles well, me. Or they could be from the area. I don't know. You could but be. Won't say, but then again, and do you know what? And do you know what it is, guys? I'm not. Oh, I'm not like I've never just like explored this area. I'm always. In inside the house, and then I'll go straight to oh, my mum's area. Yeah, Erin's. I'll go shop and back. That's it. I won't really walk around, so I wouldn't really know who's from here and who's not. Mm. Hopefully, this will heal in time, and I can just sort it out, man. But yeah, guys. Gonna lie, be, um, in July, it's been three years we've been we've moved into this yeah. house, and um, I feel like we've had a lot of altercations here, mate. Oh, bear, bear, lords. So we already plan to move, inshallah. Yeah, inshallah. We're going to move, guys. We're planning on moving from that. No, no, when, but we definitely will be moving. Like, we're not going to yeah. have an eye grow up in this area in the future. No, not in the future, guys. Because of this incident as well, me and Aisha had a proper talk about it as well. I wouldn't feel safe letting an eye walk around mm. alone in this area because of what just happened to you. Yeah, we had, we had, we had, we had like a, we had a good chat about it. You could have been with the today to the shop. Mm. Like, you went with her yesterday. It could have been you with her. Ah, uh, I was with her. Yeah. You're telling me, so it's not safe. Believe it not, guys. This is like, I live in Blackburn, but I ask her that I don't ever go out. If I go out, I take a taxi straight to town, do my thing and get home. I never ever go out, like, out my house. Right, guys, you know what? My eyes are into hell. I just want to close both of my eyes. Guys, I hope you, you know, guys, just stay, take care of yourselves, man. And, you know, stay safe. Steal it, basically. You know what I'm trying to say?